some words about state. The Lea script runtime environment preserves the internal state of the following elements. Depending on where you execute your courses and depending on the version. Lea script currently runs in three different environments. You can either share and read courses via the project website, generate SCORM packages, which can be uploaded to an LMS, or create self-containing websites. If you share your course via the website, then all the courses and the current course states are preserved within the browser database. Index DB locally. All of the states, well, dot, dot, the internal state of the previous components is only preserved. If your course has a version greater than or equal to 1.0.0, the default version is 0.0.1, which means that the course is in development mode, and thus the structure of your course might change every time. If a user reloads the course, then all states are cleared. SCORM stands for Shareable Content Object Reference Model and allows you to store the course state directly within every LMS that has support for SCORM 1.2. For this case, you have to use our exporter, which translates your course into a SCORM compliant zip file. You can check if your LMS has support for SCORM by visiting our LMS overview. You can also use our exporter tool to create single websites of your course. But, this base does only support to store user settings, such as style, mode, etc. This base connector is also used for the live server and editors. If you are a developer and want to extend the LIA script support to store state within your backend, then this is the right place to look at. This module provides an abstract class to which all stateful data is sent. You can simply inherit from this class and implement the access to your system. For more information on versioning and how to use it, check out section version within the macros section. But for now, it is okay to know that you can adapt, restructure and share your courses freely if you are in dev mode. If your course is ready to be launched, use versioning to preserve the state of your users.